Beautiful Lincoln University here in the Keystone State. CIAA action and the Lions hosting the undefeated and 10th ranked Panthers of Virginia Union. This sets up a field goal from, hey, it's special teams player of the week. A freshman out of Boone High School in Orlando. Brady Myers is on and sends it through. So the deadlock has been broken. 2.58 remaining in the first. And the Panthers are on the board. Virginia Union leading three to nothing. Okay. Freeman steps up, has a man complete across the middle, lost it. They're going to say no whistle yet. Not sure. Panthers yeah. say they have it. Was that ball complete? Was there a move made after the catch? That's the question. Well, here's the interesting thing. Either way. Oh, and you hear, the, you hear the official line judge coming in wow. saying white ball, and it is indeed going to be Panthers' ball. Maybe because of his stature, just five foot seven, but the numbers speak for themselves, and they certainly did in high school, so a lot of teams missing out. And Grant has a man on the sideline, caught by Hackey. Hackey inside the 10, and Hackey is going to find his way in. Touchdown, Panthers. Larry Hackey. Use some play action. 89 is in the game. I love it. Fourth and two from the three. Byers takes it. Byers in untouched. Touchdown, Jada Byers. He's 17th of the year, 15th on the ground. Jada Byers. And he and the Panthers offense, they don't need any help as Byers keeps it. Byers up across the 20. Byers turns on the Jets. 10, 5, touchdown. Jada Byers, his second of the ball game. You got to just square those shoulder pads and get a good block get Six inside to go Byers and he's got it Byers is in his third touchdown of the ball game that is number 19 on the season for the Garden State product and instead it's going to be number 25 Curtis Allen the big back and Allen barrels through Allen He's their goal line back, and he has his ninth touchdown of the year. Nine touches on just 28 carries. And Freeman now takes off the run, and he loses it. Ball on the turf. Panthers have it. And Virginia Union trying to continue. And that may well seal this one, the fumble from the freshman, Isaiah Freeman. Panthers put it on the ground six times today. They've lost half of those as Freeman takes to the air. 30 seconds remaining, and this is almost caught. No, it's intercepted. Able to come away with it somehow, Donald Gatling. Wow. The freshman safety with a miraculous INT. Thought that was going to be a reception. Gatling had other plans. Great concentration all the way to the ground. Gatling's been great all season covering, you know, in the back half of that defense and that secondary. He's deep as the deepest receiver. He's doing his job. And right there, just goes ahead and slides in in front of the receiver and gets a takeaway. Thanks, kid, uh, Dr. Parker. You guys, I can't say pull this and out. You ran away with it. But is it the type of performance that you expected out of from the team in terms of the penalties, turnovers today? Not at all. It wasn't a clean enough game for me today. You know, um, and everybody said it wasn't our 100% brand of football. You know, it was just some sparks that we did what we were supposed to do, but then you've seen a lot that we didn't. So, you know, we got to go back and get another week cleaned up. But, you know, we get to coach this thing from 8-0 this week. So that's that's the best part about it. So, you know, some things definitely need to be cleaned up moving forward. So, you know, um, but Lincoln's a good football club. You know, they forced some of those things, and they did a good job. So, you know, hats off to Coach Dean and his group. So, you know, we look to get back to the drawing board and make sure we clean up what we need to clean up. Coach, talk about, I mean, you're 8-0, and number 10 in the, in the nation. Talk about where you've come from to get to this point right now with this team. Um, You know, we've always been a, a good, solid team, I believe. I think we've always done what we need to be doing. But it's just a matter of just making sure that, you know, uh, we kind of keep doing what we're supposed to be doing. So it's a matter of that, you know. Um, not necessarily where we came from, but where we're trying to go to. So that's why I feel good about it. Thanks so much for your time, Coach. Congratulations again. All right. There you go. Coach 8-0 walking up the field, 45-20 to victory today. And 
joined by Jay Tobias. We talked to him last week. Jay, I think you had four touchdowns today, five touchdowns today. Four, four, four. Uh, what was that like? A lot of a lot of uh, hard hitting out there today. Uh, it was. They have a great defense, like they said. It was number three defense that I heard of before the game started, and they showed that at the beginning of the first half. And it was a tough fight, but like I always say, I have the best five, five in the nation. They came out, we picked our pants up, and we did what we had to do. Hey, what is it like for you, man? You know, given all the things that this team has had to come work through, what's next for you guys? Oh, next week, we get ready for Shawan, senior night for the seniors, let them have fun and do what they got to do, get back to the chalkboard and do what we got to do and fix what we got to fix. Let's talk a little bit about turnovers. I hate to end on a bad note, but you guys have put the ball on the ground four times today. How do you, how do you clean that up? We, we just go work home. We go back on this two-hour, no, four-hour ride, actually. We go do what we got to do, work on ball security like we do every day, and make sure we get it right. Any final thoughts on um, being undefeated, 8-0, number 10 in the nation? It, it just feels great. That's all I can say, man. This program just trying to bring us back up where we need to be at and show everybody who Virginia Union really is. Uh, how surprised are you that your name is in the Harlem Hill conversation for the Division II Player of the Year? Uh, to be honest, I'm not that surprised, but I'm just glad my talent is really getting noticed how it should have been since high school. But now it's really getting noticed. I Hopefully I do get it and finish with it. But like I say, we're just going to do what we got to do. How do you keep your head? You know, Coach last week came out in the field. Nobody had a big head. Everybody was ready to work back in the salt mine. How, how do you do the same having that type of notoriety now? Oh, we just got to know who we is. We just got to be us. Like I always, Coach always tell us, can't nobody be us but us. If we make little mistakes, that's going to cause us to do what we got to do, have a tough fight like we just had right now. Four turnovers, in my eyes, you shouldn't win the ball game with that. But our, our talent and our skill and our depth back everything up for us so we can just get the job done. All right, Jada Byers, man, congratulations again, man. Have a good weekend. Four touchdown performance for him today in a 45-20 to victory.